Okay, let's go to page 711 and start with number 1. Okay, so you have this data, 16, 54, 23, 38, 22, 22, 40, 46, 52, 19, and 20. I just make sure I copy it correctly. Okay, you want to draw a stem and leaf plot for the giving distribution. Okay, so you have the stem and you have the leaf. So let's start with one. So uh, let's see. So you got 16 and 19, so be 6 and 9. Okay, so that takes care of these two. Or you can just put a check mark. Okay, so is that all the 10? Yes, okay, then let's go to the 20s. Okay, so you got two zero, 20, and then you got 22, 22. So when the data, data is kind of scrambled, it's kind of, you kind of have to watch it carefully and get all of them. So 23, okay, any more 20s? That's it. Okay, and let's go to 30s. So only one is 30, so it'd be 38. And let's go to the 40s. So you got 40 and 46. And let's just go to the 50s. So we've got 52 and 54. Okay. Okay, got everything. Okay, so that's the so that's the the stem and leaf plot. Okay. Okay, let's go to number three. So you got two, five, thirteen, twenty-eight, sixty-one, nine, uh, eighteen. 10, 52, 34, 28, 42, 19, 28, and 7. Okay, let me count. I'm just double checking, make sure I got every number. Okay. Okay, so you got stem and leaf. So let's start with the, the zero, okay? The, the tenth digit is zero, so you got zero two. So that takes care of this one. Then you got zero five, okay, that takes care of that one. And oh, that's a seven right over here. Okay, then let's go to the tenth. Uh, you got one ten, uh, one zero, and then you got, uh, let's see. Oh, we missed one right over here. That's a nine over here. So you have to keep things organized, okay? So you got 13 here, and you got 19 here. Again, you have to do this in order, right? Okay, that take care of all the 10. Okay, let's go to the 20s. Uh, there's, oh, that's 18 right over here. So we got eight and nine, okay? Okay, we missed the 18, so you have to put it back in here. Okay, the 20s, so you got 28 and 28. So you might want to use a pencil. Use a pencil, that way if you miss something, then you can kind of squeeze in there or erase, okay? Okay, that takes us to 20s, then you got 30s. That's 34 right over here, okay? And the 40s, so that's 42 over here. And then the 50s, and the 52s, and 61, okay? Let me double check if I got all the numbers. Uh, uh, missing one right over here. That's another 28 over here. See that? Okay. So we need to go back and see that's where you want to put a check mark. That way you miss something you can see. You also want to count total numbers. So there are 15 numbers over here and I only count 14. Okay. So, so you have to put this 8 right over here. So I got another 28 right over here. Okay. There we go. And that's your stem and leaf plot. Okay. Okay, now let's go to number five. Okay, so number five, you have to use this to answer the question. Okay, so number five, you have to find the mode. Okay. So A. Uh, so five A. So five number five using the, the data from number one. Okay, so the mode is the one shows up most often. So it would be 22 right over here. This one shows up twice. So it would be 22. Okay. And the B 
you have to find the median, the middle number. Now this is all scrambled, so you don't want to use this one. So you want to use this one, so it'll be like this. I can go from lowest and the highest, okay? And just go like this and just go move one number at a time. And so the 23 is your middle number. Okay. And okay, and next one you want to find the mean. Okay. Um, the mean is a capital letter M. Okay, so mean is the average. So you have to add all this together and divide. Okay, so you got 16 plus 19 plus 20 plus 22 plus 22 plus 23 plus 38 plus 40 plus 46 plus 52 plus 54 equal. So make sure you write down your sum, okay? So when you do this, show your work. So you need to show this so I know, so people know what your, your sum is. You have to divide by the total numbers, 11. So there are 11 numbers. Okay. So you divide by 11 and equal. So they'll give you 31.9. Okay. Um, let me see. Does it ask you to... They kind of run it off. If you keep it at 31.9, that's fine. If you run it to 32, that's fine. Okay? Either way. Okay, let's go to number 7. So number 7, we use the data from number 3. Okay, so same thing. So the mode will equal to... Uh, the one shows up most often... Notice it shows up twice. Okay? Uh... So, wait, 28, yeah, and 8. Oh, I put this in the wrong place. I put this in the wrong place. The 28 is over here. Nah. Sorry about that. Go back and fix it. So you have to be careful with your, with your data, okay? So 28, 28, 28, yeah, okay. So sorry about that, I put it in the wrong place. Okay, so in this case, your mode is 28 because it shows up three times. So again, when you put in your data, you have to be careful, like over here, I, you know, instead of putting over here, I put up there, was not paying attention to the stem, okay? So make sure you, you, you know, pay attention to your data. Very easy to make careless mistakes. Okay, so let's, let's go to the median. Again, you go from the lowest and the highest, and you just go down, look for the middle number. Oh, so, Medium number is 19. Okay? Okay. So that's the B. Now C is your mean. So you have to add all this together. Now when you're adding, you probably can use this list either way. Okay? So, so you can use either, either, either list. So this one is probably harder to see. So when you add, probably easier to use this list. Okay? So you can go 2 plus 5 plus 13 plus 28 plus 61 plus 9 plus 18 plus 10 plus 52 plus 34 plus 28 plus 42 plus 19 plus 28 plus 7 equal okay so equal to 356 divided by 15 okay and let's go divide by 15 equal, so you get 23.7, okay? And so that's it for this one, okay? Okay. Let's go to the next problem. Okay, number nine, the frequency of the height is shown, and then you want to find the mole, the median, the mean. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to write out all the numbers, okay? So 175 shows up one time, then we've got 178, and then 180, 180, okay? And then we've got 181, and 184, 184, and 184, that was three times, and 185, 185 because it shows up twice. And you got 188, 180, 
Oh, wait, 192. Yeah, so again, just be careful. So 188, 192. Okay, so, so part A, you're looking for the mode. The mode is one shows up most often, so from the frequency distribution, you can see that it's going to be 184. Okay, because it shows up three times, right? It tells you in the table. Okay, part B, you want to find the median. Okay, then that's the middle number, so you start from both ends and just keep go toward the middle. Okay. Okay, so now you got two middle numbers, but both are the same, so you so you're going to average and you're still going to get 184. Okay. Now most of the time these numbers are going to be different. Okay. So it just happened in this case they they're just the same. Okay. Then you need to see look for the mean. Okay. That's going to add all this together. So 175 plus 178 plus 180 times 2 plus 181 plus 184 times 3 plus 185 times 2 plus 188 plus 192 equal. Okay, so equal to 2196. Okay, again, make sure you show this step. Okay, so that way, you know, if, if you make careless mistakes, you still can get most of the points. Okay, and then this is 12. So there are 12 numbers. Okay, so you divide it by 12, push equal, so you got um, 183. Okay. Okay, number 11. It says so the histogram for the frequent distribution of the quiz score shown on the right. Okay, so to make the table, okay, so you're going to go from 2 through 10. Okay, up here. Okay, so the first one, the score of 10 is 2. Okay. Uh, so this is 10. And the 15 is 5. So the score of 15 is 5 high. And then 20 is 8. Okay, and then the 25 is 15. Okay, and then 30 is 10. Okay, so that's it. Okay, so again, this is the 2, the 5, the 8. And then the 15 and the 10. Okay, and so that's, that's your answer for number 11.